Hyundai Heavy Industries showcased their offered Corvette to the Philippine Navy, the HEF 3100 Corvette design. A large and more capable version of the Philippine Navy's Jose Rizal class light frigate. Hyundai Heavy Industries is one of the competitors in the Philippine Navy's Corvette acquisition project being fast-tracked under Horizon 2 phase priority projects of the revised AFP modernization program. In 2018, Max Defense Philippines proposed improvement in the superstructure midsection gap to improve its reduction of radar cross-section, which has been implemented. The HEF 3100 Corvette design offered to the Philippine Navy will be armed with 76mm Auto Malara Super Rapid Gun, mounted in a stealth cupola, unconfirmed number of vertical launching system, unconfirmed number of surface-to-surface -surface missiles and torpedo tubes and a close-in weapon system, possibly the 35mm Aselsan Gokdanese, an airburst ammunition, all-weather capable, dual-barrel close-in weapon system developed by Turkish defense company, Aselsan. The 35mm Aselsan Gokdanese close-in weapon system is one of the potential weapon system to be installed to the Philippine Navy's Jose Rizal class frigates. Max Defense Philippines reported that Hanwa System signed contract with Hyundai Heavy Industries to supply the baseline 4 series Naval Shield Integrated Combat Management System for the Philippine Navy's two units of HDF-3100 guided missile corvettes currently being built by Hyundai Heavy Industries in Ulsan, South Korea. Max Defense Philippines also added that Hyundai Heavy Industries signed a contract with Israel Aerospace Industries to supply with Elta ELM-2258 advanced lightweight phased array radar with effective range of 200 km, while the extended variant at 400 km from previously offered British-based Hensel TRS-4D radar with effective range of up to 250 km. If pushed through, the HDF-3100 Corvette is by far the most modern and capable ship the Philippine Navy could ever have. Knowing the Jose Rizal class frigates undergo several issues and alleged corruption from the Philippine Navy. End.